Hi, it's Emerson at Tyrium Games. I've just got a quick update for you. Uh, I've been working a little bit on the uh, on the basic environment that I have here. Uh, I've got some tall grass that sways in the wind. Uh, I've got short grass that doesn't do anything, just hangs out, but it's got a bit more colour variation and, and that looks quite neat. Got some weird looking bubble trees that uh, are sort of one colour on one side and another on the other and a bit of a shine. Uh, at the moment they're just using the same uh, texture as the handle so oh, that looks okay for now and I've also got a, a little bit of a depth thing happening with a, um, uh, I can't think of what it's called the, let me see if I can find that thing, this thing the, um, let's have a look, what's that called? the exponential height fog, cool name, brah and uh, so that what that does is gives everything a little bit of depth you see how the, the colour changes um, just a little bit of fog quite like it, just a uh, bit of amb ambience uh, but more importantly what I've got uh, I've added the audio clips and made three child blueprints so th I've got the base class and now I've got three child classes that carry just the the weapon and the mesh uh, and the audio clips for each of these little guys and I'll show you what that sounds like it um, I'm gonna smack your head in. So that's the voice of uh, T14, the welder, <laughs> my glorious nephew, who uh, sent me the audio clips, which I've just <laughs> I've spent the <laughs> spent the afternoon <laughs> cutting up and uh, adding to the oh, ca characters. <laughs> so they fire at random. <laughs> Oh, ironically, what you doing over there? What you doing over there? Keeps, <laughs> keeps firing the same one. It's the way it works with random. Hey, mate, I'm done. And then uh, these guys. So you've got that ninja guy and the hillbilly guy, and they'll fight each other to the death. Uh, at the moment, it only makes one sound on Discovery, which I need to re-trigger, depending on. Um, Depending on who it is, so I've still got all the you know the weapon, weapon switching and all that. But uh, yeah, so um, I think that's about it for updates at the moment. Uh, it, for those interested in how to set up the uh, child blueprints, <laughs> the child blueprints are so you've got your uh, my rather uh, complicated, overly complicated uh, blueprint. I could separate it into functions and stuff, but I just want to keep it on one big block to start with, and then I'll break it down later I know where everything is um, and then these are child what a child blueprint looks like so inside the child blueprints I've just got uh, the audio so far for each one and uh, change the, the, the texture on the mesh and the uh, actual mesh the, the weapon mesh and there you have it that's all it is very simple uh, and what that means is I can make one change to the main uh, the main blueprint and then it flows, uh, it cascades to all the others, which is the main power of, of the uh, of the blueprint. So I could do the same with the character blueprint if I wanted to. Uh, and what I'll do next is break it into AI and, and player, but it's just been better for testing to make sure that everything's on the same on both. So anyway, uh, that's just today's little update. I hope that was interesting to somebody out there. Um, I've I just been cracking up at this audio. I might 1v1 me, bro. <laughs> uh, but my own audio of the uh, of this guy is not so good. <laughs> not the question, but request the answer. Yes, ask not the question, but request the answer. He's already made his audio, so we'll just have to... Be the beginning. I think one of the audio clips is broken. He's supposed to go, hi. Hey. Anyway, that's that's. <laughs> I do not understand how you. Oh, and we both go down. So yeah, that's where we're at the moment. The AI fights each other. Uh, they've all got independent. So what I can do now is add sort of uh, speed to the ninja, strength to the builder, and um, and defense to the farmer. This guy. So there you go. Oh. Hope you enjoyed that. Um, I'll keep you posted with more updates as I get going. Thanks for watching.